So looking at the brackets, well, in the top half, you've got the winner of this match possibly playing defending champions Matsuyama and Shida or Zhang Jixian and Zheng Yu, Matsumoto and Nagahara, Kim Kong, Miyara and Sakuramoto, and of course, Big Hana and Lee So He still in the mix as we move into the semi-finals. And here they come, Li Wenmei and Liu Zhuanzuan, the world number 16s. Second round exit in last year's event. But more significantly, quarter-finalists in the Malaysia Open that kicked off the season last week. And Ying Na Ting and Ying Fui Lam who have put in a bit of a show this week. In the world number 19 pair. Well, this could be absolutely exhilarating match. Very evenly matched. Five seeds left in the women's doubles competition. And that is and looking at the head to head. And as I said, could be very tight. All England was the last time they won, and that was won by Lee and Liu. I've got red with and an black. epic second game. Red, red for them. Come this side. Red. It's good. Who okay. serve? Go serve. Who receive? Can receive. Well, what can they do here? Mm. Well, as I said, five seeds left. Uh, no Chen and Jia this week. Of course, they withdrew. Big Han Ali So He, Kim So Yong, Kong Hee Yong, uh, defending champions Matsuyama and Shida, Zhang and Zheng, and Matsumoto and, Wa and Nagahara. Of course, no. Rahayu and Robert Hunty, they also withdrew. So a healthy, evolving competition in the women's doubles, but it's Young and Young that have been a bit of a surprise this week, I guess. 25 years old, born in Hong Kong, China, as I said, currently 19th. And there's her partner, Young Kui Lam. But they have had a pretty good run so far. That's for sure. There's their tournament results. It was Panda and Panda, the Indian pairing. Motor from the reserves in 31 minutes. And uh, Vivian Hu and Lim Chu Xian in an epic match that did see them dropping a game. That was yesterday. But of course, up against a Chinese pairing, that's always going to be a bit of an ask. 23 years old, Liu Zhuanzuan. All these young players coming through the ranks. Rank 16th has been as high as 14, and that was in July of last year. Gold medalist at the Uber Cup. Gold medalist at the World University Games. Li Wenmei, her partner, 24 years old, born in Hubei. And together, they picked up a lot of good results along the way in 2023. This is their tournament so far. Ready to serve. Banana ready, ready to play. from the U.S. in 30 minutes. And Su Ya Ching and Lin Wan Ching in Chinese Taipei. Haven't dropped a game yet. That's the only real difference between these two pairs. Deepak Tapa is our umpire. Joined by our service judge, BD Chaturanga. So almost ready to get underway here.
Ready? Ladies and gentlemen, on my right, Li Wei Ming and Liu Xuan Xuan, China. And on my left, Yong Na Tin and Yong Hui Lam, Hong Kong, China. Liu Feng Swing to serve to Yang Na Ten La Ball Play. So can Yung Yun pull off another big win here? This is only the second quarterfinal in over a year. The last quarterfinal they made was won the love. Denmark Open and we were also quarterfinalists at the Asian Games last year. To love. And on that occasion, the Asian Games, they lost to Kim and Kong. Points for Li and Liu. Three love. So far, they've made a bright start. Bolt. Ball. Love. That's Young Yao Ting. It's over. It's One ball. Good, solid backcourt work. Is their first point on the board. It's a good pick up. Good commitment to the course. Yung Ti Lam. Well, as was proved against the Malaysian pair yesterday, Yung and Yung quite happy to play out over. every rally and take it right to. Bye. Death, but it's a question of whether they're going to get that opportunity. Li and Liu again, another pair that likes to set a very quick pace. If they can get into their groove. Very adequate defense as well. Not maybe that not on that occasion, but three. We have five. Done very well. Just be 
unforced errors that make the difference. But as I said, they are very evenly matched, 16th and 19th in the rankings. And those rankings are very, very accurate when it comes down to it. So much information, of course, feeds into the rankings and that they are hardly off the mark. That is over. Four, six. And they've done well here after being four love down. Getting into a nice rhythm. Lively rallies. Oh. Even mate, guilty there. Six. Just oh. take your eye off the shuttle. Bang. Don't fist me. hitting zone for Pui Lam. Seven, six. Change. That is over. Seven all. Another lively rally. Eight, and there's absolutely seven. nothing between them right now, these pairs. Nine, seven. A few rallies to get into the rhythm of it, but both pairs are looking effective enough. And 
as we approach the first mid-game interval. Seven. Being Liu, that edge ahead. Lamp on the Hong Kong side, shouldering all the responsibility in this rally. Almost single-handedly there, and interval. it's 11-7 at the first break. Eleven seven. Lay. Twelve seven. So Lin Yu beginning to assert some dominance, but they're having to fight for every point. Oh, a couple of arrows creeping in. Eighteen. Seven. Fourteen. Oh. Main. Seven. These ones on, of course, made the quarterfinals at Young and Young's home open. Hong Kong Open last year. Four, also made the quarterfinals at the career open. And picked up a good third place. Uh, the Singapore Open back in June of 2023. That's after a very tight opening. Words from their coach at the mid-game interval have proved valuable as they are now tussling. Yuan Mei from the back. The defense is absolutely resolute. That was Pui Lam that... 15 Missed that shot. 7. So 15 7. Of course, those weren't the only results that. Lee-Win May and Liu one picked up so last good. year. They didn't win any titles, has to be stressed. They also picked up another e third spot at the Thailand 15. Masters. Got a finalist at the All England. And the Malaysia Open to kick off the season in 2023. So, close. But never quite made it to final Sunday. They would love to do that here in the second event of the year for 2024. Oh, 
Oh, that was great from Lian Young. 9 15. Turn by Puilam. And it really did shift the 15, complexion of that rally. 15. Play. So they hit double digits. Still, is creeping in. 16, 10. Great vision from Liu and Mei. 17, 10. And beginning to find spaces left and right. Li and Liu. As they said, have an iron grip on this game. That they're probably going to look to pull in for the second it game. We've been guilty of that a couple of times. 11. 17. Based on Li Wen Mei's expression, she's fully aware of it too. That's very high. been called in I wonder if we're gonna see a challenge no 12 we have to seven that you get the replay coming a bit fast yeah, that's absolutely on the money back well within the lines wonderful shot Nice pick up there by Puilim. And they both watch that sail wide. That was good pressure from the Hong Kong Pep. 13, 17. Over 18 13. So service back and closing in on the culmination of this first game 18 13. Lee May and Liu Zhuanzuan have done a fantastic job in forcing the Hong Kong pair into defensive patterns. And then, as you see, just pushing forward whenever they can, looking 19, for that opportunity, being 18. patient. 
That's the important factor. Waiting for the right opportunity. In this case, it's Lee Wenmei. A couple of steps forward. And they push and they've been doing that the second half of the first game very very well and unless you and you can find a way to counteract that that's going to be a thorn in their side gonna go wide so it is seven game points 20 and game point 13 looking at it from an overview based on the effort that's been put in by Lee and Liu in this second part of the game they deserve it oh very fast return by that is so very young She's quite effective when she 20. moves forward into that front court area. Fifteen twenty. So five game points left. Wine. They're having trouble game. on that left side. So 21 15. First game won by and Lee and Liu. Lee Yu with one foot and in the same. Lee Swan Swan. 21 15. Also,不要着急 守不住的<音樂> Game two, and the focus is all on Jung and Jung from Hong Kong. They can be happy, of course, with game. the quarterfinal in the second event of the year. But, well, they'd be even Play. happier if it was a semi final, and of course, over the moon if they can make it to the final. A lot of obstacles lie in their way. Pui Lam still One dragging love. a little bit on the left side. Now that she shifted to that top side of the court, that's of course our right side as we watch the match. And let's see what they can do for Lee and Yu. While well, they can play a little bit more freer, they are playing with that tiny bit of drift behind them, but 
we've certainly got a good idea as to what they need to do to see out these rallies and come out on top. And so far, it's, it's a question Two of waiting love. for the error from Jung and Jung. One's one. Three, low. Have a look at this. Flat, just a little push into that left side, and enough. And again, dropped in. Four, I think that was low. News one's one again. A quick motion to play, but four love up. May mean business. Sometimes it can help. Of course, drift mechanics in doubles are a little bit different, but just gives that Five. little bit of extra Love. punch to the attack. Having a bit of wind behind you, especially on those downward angle shots into mid court. That is over. One five. Be happy to get their first point on the board. So flat, that return again. I think that's really where the focus Six, of two. their play is going. They're trying to keep it as flat as possible and playing a mid-court game. That's good pressure. That is over by Lian Young. Three, six. Gets on it there, and that final blow was a lot of sting and venom to it. Well, they need to get more of that in. Over. Just lurking at Seven. the net. And as Three. soon as she found that angle, moves forward here. It's a body shot. The blind side, backhand side of Yan Young. Almost impossible to retrieve. Well placed. That's gone long. Eight, three. Nineteen, eighteen, twenty. Mm, over. A little bit too low. Four, eight. Picked up the pace, Lee Liu off the start, just making sure that they're hustling very quickly. These early parts of the rally, as soon as they get control, and they can start powering in attempted winners.
good defense by the Hong Kong player. Looked like it was very close. It is over. Oh, that's bounced Nine, out. four. Whereas Lee and you have. As I was saying, Lee and Liu have a tried and trusted formula now in this second game as to how to win points by pressuring at the net. And also picking up a few points here and there by mistakes. And it's over. Liu and Liu yet to find that Five, nine. trusted plan that they can aim at. Still very reactive to what is happening on the other side of the court. But they are at least putting the work in, and that's what's most important. That's exactly what they did in that three-game thriller against the Malaysians yesterday. Five nine. Oh, that's great power from New Swan Swan from the back. Lee May just waiting. Oh, that's wonderful. What a reply Six, by Lian Young. Nine. Great control. It's over. Dean, six. Well, that shuttle had to be retrieved from court one. Now it's back. And we're all very thankful to Lian Young for making that trek past the cameras and over the A boards. Now back to the business at hand, which is. Oh, just out. That is over. So close. Seven, ten. And the business at hand for Nian Young and Pui Lim is to try and get into the second mid game interval at least close enough. That is over. Oh, 11 7 is going to have to do. Interval. Lee and Liu in good position here. So back on court. And this could be the face 11, of play seven. that sends Lee Wenmei and Liu Zhuantuan into the semi finals. And they know it. They're coming out firing. They force that. To go long at the back. Well, seven. Lian Yang just questioning, I think, the possibly the service with the umpire, but 
And again. I may have been as to who was actually serving. Quick-fire mistakes and things 18, are beginning to get seven. very tight for the Hong Kong ladies. Oh, they just 14, can't seem to settle into seven. any kind of rhythm. And Li and Liu are just playing through the rallies as best as they can. It's all they need to do. 14-7, seven, seven points ahead, and seven points needed. Out. That is over. That's a good chance for Eight. Jung and Jung. 14. That's very high, and you knew that was going to come back steep and with power, especially 15, from the racket of lose one's run. Eight. Just can't leave eight. things that high in hitting zone of a player of her quality. So 15-8, and it's a huge task from here to overcome this deficit. And of course, try and find if they could make a third deciding game. That formula, as I said, they really have been reacting to Li and Liu, just as they are right now. Whereas Li and Liu have more of a focused idea as to what they want to do. They're happy to sit back in defense. And when they want to come forward, they have the weapons to do it. That might be very soon in this rally. That is over. A mistake. Nine fifteen. Well, they're trying to engineer something. Leanne and Puilim. That is over. But the tempo just keeps increasing. 16. And the nine. points keep falling to Lee and Liu. So quick, such a nine. tricky serve for Lian Young to try and get on to. 17-9. And that is over. again, just net. Nothing else. 17. 17. Well, they've got a few chances. Lian and Pui Lim. A couple of errors from Lee Wen Mei. Halt. Then it's over. He's gone begging as well. 18. So they're three points 10. away from the semi finals. from Puy Lim. 
Kang Yin switches the play. And it's nineteen. nice Peng. return from Li Wenmei that's irretrievable. Two points away now. Oh, that was good play by the end. It's over. 11. Opted for the round ahead. 19. And caught Lee Wen Mei by surprise. And I do have to say that I think that of the pairing, News One's one has been very, very effective indeed. Lee Wen Mei has been a little bit down on the statistics. Flavera's coming from her. Usual self, but she's done enough there. That's a beautiful little drop over. shot. And so, nine match points. Match point, 11. And it was tightly contested for the first oh, half of so game nice. one. And since then, Lee and Lee have always really had the upper hand. And I fully expect them to only need one or two of these match points. And there it is. Game. Mistake. So 21 15, 21 11. Lee Wen Mei and Liu Zhuan Zhuan make their first semi final after making the quarterfinals in Malaysia last week. Anyways. Good run of results for them, especially Matt, as they one move towards, of course, the, Li the end of the Li Paris qualification and Li period. Zhuang Zhuang. 21 Very 15, solid stuff from them. 21 11. Lee Wen Mei may be the weaker of the pair on the day but they now have another day of course coming up and it makes all the difference because it gives them a chance to correct everything there's the confirmation of it 21 15 21 11 in 39 minutes On court two, and it's been all about straight games. The first three matches, and up next, it's the men's singles. Lizzy Jia in his first quarterfinal of the year, up against Koda Naroka, the number two seed. Well, for the men's singles, there are three.